Hey, how's it going everyone? Mr. Kader and I'm bringing you a tips video today just on how to make your triggers a bit more sensitive and controlled and a bit more reactive on your Xbox One controller when playing FPS um, shooter games. Um, so basically on the Xbox 360 um, there was a scuff and the scuff controller used to have trigger stops so when you pressed either the left trigger or the right trigger um, you could tailor the trigger stops to to stop where you wanted them to now you have this functionality on your Xbox one controller but if you have a look at this controller here when you press the button it goes fully down on the Xbox 360 version it would press and stop here and when you burst fire it allows you to control the recoil and the shot a lot better now what I don't like is you you have to push it all the way down and when you're playing Call of Duty and those types of games that one second two seconds can make a big difference so what we want to do is just make that a little bit more comfortable for you so firstly what you need to do is take off this and if you can see in here there's a, there's a gap here and we have a little bit of cushioning here from Xbox so what you want is a little bit of foam and you just simply slot it into this corner here make sure it's fully in and then you'll see when you push down, it gives you just a little bit of comfort and a little bit of cushioning when you fire. You can push it down quickly and you don't need to push it all the way down and it won't fully go down. And that will enable you then to burst and control your burst fire a lot better. So it's a very simple technique and you just put your the grip back on. It's a very simple technique and it works on Xbox One Scuff, which we have here. Xbox One Elite and just a normal controller. So yeah, thanks for the t thanks for watching the video, and uh, yeah, see you soon. Bye.